In today's short video, I'm going to show you the difference temperature makes while utilizing these solar panels. I did just do a review on these particular ones from EcoFlow. So first we'll go over the specs and then I'll show you the difference in temperature. These 100 watt solar panels come in with an open circuit voltage of 20.3 volts and a short circuit of 6.3 amps. The max P is 17.1 volts and a max of 5.9 amps, which we'll test later. And this has a max system voltage of 600 volts DC and it is a class C panel. These new panels utilize half cut cells and also have a 10 bus bar configuration. Okay, so when I did do the testing on these panels, I had them set up in series and the outside temp is almost 100 degrees. And both of these I made sure were at the same angle, getting about a thousand watts meter square on the little light meter here as you can see. And then I went ahead and did some testing. Now the surface temperature of both of these panels are about 130 degrees plus. They're really hot. But we're going to see what it looks like now plugged into this EcoFlow Delta 2 power station. Now you can see it's getting about 160 watts and I'll show you another meter that shows us some more information. Now this is just a power analyzer that shows us a little bit more information like our amperage. It shows volts, watts, and even accumulation of watt hours from the solar panels. And I'll get the glare off of here, but you can see about 5.4 amps, getting about 29 volts and almost 160 watts. And now I'll show you the difference what it looks like when it's about 60 degrees outside. Okay, so first I'll show you the surface temperature of the panels. Now current temperature is about 61 degrees Fahrenheit. And as we look at the surface temp, you can see these are about 115 degrees each, which is extremely hot, even though the outside temperature isn't that much. Now, when it was 100 degrees outside, the surface temp was over 135. They were extremely hot. And I'll show you the concrete, actually, just to show you that it is pretty cold outside. Here's the concrete in the sun at almost 70 degrees. And now in the shade, right about 55, 56 degrees. Okay, so now we'll take a look at the meter, and again, these are in series, and they're not hooked up at the moment. They're just showing our open circuit voltage, which is almost maxed out, about 38 and a half volts. So now we'll connect them. Okay, now we're plugged back into the power station, and let me get the glare off of here so we can see the numbers a little bit. Now, before, we had about 5.4 amps coming in, and as you can see, now we're at about 5.8, and then voltage-wise, we had about 28 and a half to 29 and a half, and now almost 32 volts. And our wattage has come up from 160 watts to now 185 watts. So it took a 40 degree temperature swing in order to see a 25 watt gain. Now obviously if you have like a thousand watt setup, you're going to see a much larger difference. But it just comes to show you that a few degrees in temperature isn't going to change your output numbers that much. You need a pretty big swing of temperature in order to see a notable gain or losses and not to mention the conditions of the skies whether it might be a little hazy or smoky outside and also the angle of the panels as relationship to the sun. If you're interested in seeing more EcoFlow products, check out one of these two videos right here.